Hey everyone, today I'm going to talk about the misconception of feelings. Now this is monumental, this is super, super important topic area. Because of the fact that we live with a feeling, we, we, we are constantly feeling. And eventually, whatever we end up, like the state of feeling that we're in the most is our consistent feeling. And yeah, that that's what we basically live in. Now, obviously, we have feelings and emotions to things, so it it can go up and down, or you don't even have to consider it up and down. You know, you can just feel different things. We we don't have to uh, classify um, you know sadness as a bad thing or or happiness as a good thing because in reality, it's it's good to feel sad when you're sad because then you get a chance to release it. You're not keeping in that feeling which can eventually turn into a consistent state of feeling and turn into things like depression. So it's really important to become aware of a feeling and I've actually noticed that even crying is it's it's a really good thing. It it actually makes you feel good and it and it releases uh, what's there and and brings you to a, a stronger understanding. Anyway, there's there's a big misconception around feelings especially uh, especially guys, um, you know, it's a stereotype and the fact that you know like um, that we're, I guess, not supposed to feel or, or be in touch with our emotions and whatnot, but um, that that's just repression. That just that just holds it back, and it's 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 still all there, and, and eventually um, has to be released. So let's just think of feeling in a new way, because we're always feeling something, and that ends up um, that that's what well-being really is. It's it's living in a it's living in a feeling. So, the more that we become aware of our feelings and be willing to talk about our feelings, but more importantly, aware of our feelings, we can ensure that we are in more of a consistent good feeling state, which is where we get more done, which is which is the type of people that we actually attract, which is um, it it then um, relates to us having more positive thinking. It's 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 very very important how we are feeling and. The reason why it's so important is because you deserve to feel good. You truly deserve to feel good. And it's not about anyone else giving us these good feelings. It's not about anyone else giving us a good life. It's about ourselves giving ourselves love, giving ourselves good feelings, and ensuring that we are feeling good. So when we are more aware of our feelings, we we can know when you know we're more feeling um, in say a, a negative way or just not feeling good or feeling discomfort and then we can find the root cause of this before it becomes a, a big re repression thing and then we don't even know why we're, we're say lashing out at somebody or, or or why we're depressed or whatnot and and it's really good as well to be aware of of how good we're feeling and whatnot because then we know what what we like and and, and what we want and we can keep creating more of that because even feelings end up relating a lot to do with um, w with our thinking patterns and whatnot and if we are uh, if, if we're constantly thinking and we don't take time to feel then our thinking patterns can turn into something more uh, negative you know we can we can have thoughts about ourselves that say, you know, oh, I'm not good enough, or oh, I can't do this, or whatnot. And if we're not paying attention to how that makes us feel, then we might not realize that we're actually doing damage to ourselves. It's it, it's all about giving ourselves the best life, and we deserve that. Now, that there's a lot more to say on feelings, but I want to keep these videos shorter. But I just want to bring out that awareness here of how important it is to know how we're feeling. Our, our feelings are like a GPS system. They, they guide us through life. So if something isn't feeling good, then, then that means it doesn't resonate with, with the core of ourselves. So it, it's something that we, we, we definitely want to look at because we deserve to give ourself the best feeling, the best life, the best, the best everything. We deserve it. Anyway... That's all I'll be talking about today. I'm going to go back to drinking my juice drink. Peace and love. And if, you know, if you've been feeling um, in a more of a negative state for, for a while, or you just you, you even have feelings that come up that you don't 
don't really understand or how to deal with, then I would I would love to talk with you about it, or um, I'd love to uh, do some more videos on um, dealing with feelings and whatnot because <laughs> feelings are everything. They're 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 even more important than our thoughts because we live in a feeling, and I want everybody to feel good. That's yeah. That's, that would be my dream if, if, if everybody in the world felt absolutely amazing and every day on the streets we're walking around just giving each other high fives, you know, just having a fucking blast. That's what it's all about. Anyway, take it easy. Peace and love.